Apple has already sent out updates for tvOS, iPadOS, iOS, and watchOS. But wait, there's something missing. Where's macOS? Exclusive information about macOS 11 Big Sur confirmed release date. Watch this video till the end without skipping because you don't want to miss out on anything I mentioned today. What's up guys, Arik everything here and welcome to this new video. Hope everyone's doing great, quite an unexpected video. But before I get into this, I would like to quickly thank you all for 1000 subscribers. But that is going to be a whole different video for thanking you all. So talking about Big Sur, let me start off with this. So basically, we know that the Apple event for this November has been announced with the tagline one more thing on the 10th of this month. We are expecting a very Mac centric event with the Apple Silicon Max. Now let's keep that in mind and move on to the next point. Apple also seeded the macOS 11.0.1 beta last week and the 11.0.1 release candidate a few days ago. But there was no release candidate for the 11 build or like the macOS 11, not 0.1 or you get my point, which I found quite weird. Probably hinting that 11.0.1 is what ships with the Apple Silicon Max. Now let's have a look at this from another point of view. I know this is a lot of point of views, but bear with me. MacOS 11. The 11 is a big jump from the macOS 10 we all have been used to. And the event is on 10th November. And do you know what happened last time at the September event? The next day we got iOS, iPadOS, tvOS 14 and watchOS 7. Okay, yeah, but you're probably like, so what? This clearly points out that macOS 11 will be released on the next day of the event that is 11th of November. Now I'm pretty sure you guys are like, but Apple can change the plans and schedule the update differently. Well, I thought so too. But the event is on 10th of November for a reason. And the reason is that the next day is the 11th. The 11th day of the 11th month of the year and the 11th macOS version starting to make sense, isn't it? And I think Apple has been aiming for this all this time. And I tweeted about this a few days ago. And just like iOS 14 and the other operating systems Apple launched last time, I'd expect the release candidate for macOS 11 to be out right after the event on the 10th. But again, I would like to mention I'm neither a leaker nor a very trusted source, but I've made a couple of predictions about Apple correctly previously. I hope this one is correct too. But I'm almost positive that this is true and macOS 11 is dropping this week on 11th of November. And I'm absolutely excited for what Apple has to offer for us with this new update and the new Apple Silicon Max. Thank you for sticking with me till the end. And if this video helped you out even a tiny bit, do consider subscribing to my channel and hitting that like button. Also leave your thoughts in the comment section down below. And yeah, you can expect a lot of videos on the iPad Air for this month because my iPad Air has shipped and is coming very soon. Probably is in my hands by the time you watch this video. Just as a side note, I've got my community tab unlocked, so I post a lot there, almost on a daily basis, so check it out for sure. Hope you enjoyed this video with a slightly fast-paced voice, and thank you for watching. I will catch you all in the next one in this week.